Ladies and gentlemen, the American Jury and Bulldog Nation, does anybody believe that a raid on Rudy Giuliani's office is not political theater? Are you kidding me? Look what they did to Tim, uh, to General Flynn, did to all these other people. You know, it's a joke. And I got to ask you a question. Rudy Giuliani might be a lot of things. I don't believe Rudy Giuliani's a crook. And not only that, if they were having discussions with them, I have to admit, think that Rudy Giuliani is smart enough. He ain't going to have jack on anything. And not only that, he had him and his lawyers had to be thinking, yep, they would even raid my office too. But I'm sorry, folks, I just don't think Rudy Giuliani is a crook. And what really bothers me is this apparently has to deal with Ukraine. Really? Ukraine? Hunter? Joe Biden? It's enough to make me furious. Hunter Biden gets a book tour, a Tulane speaking tour, all these other things. Nothing. Nothing about his Ukraine work. And then there's the John Kerry, but I'm going to get to next. Andrew Brown Jr., whoa, the North Carolina black shooting. Judge won't release the tapes. What do we find out? They lied. Crump lied. Brown apparently hit the cops with his car. What do you think about that? Hit the cops with the car, among other things, apparently. Wow. Little different, isn't it? Uh, John Kerry. John Kerry is accused by his friends. He's buddies with the Iranians. The Iranians say he was telling them what Israel was doing in Syria. The networks do not cover it. NBC, CBS, ABC, they don't even cover the story. See how the American Communist 10 works? in collaboration. I'm going to do a show this weekend explaining it, how they all work in collaboration. Fauci now says that kids need masks even outside. Well, 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 Dr. Fauci, do you believe he's like Rasputin, Hitler? I mean, he's, he's one of these people that everybody just follows blindly. Half the country follows him blindly. What do you have to say about this? Oh, I say this. What the hell? He's a little Nimrod. Louisville Police Department. This ought to scare the hat of. It's pretty close to home here, isn't it? Louisville, a Democratic city, though. 200 cops gone. I understand only 70 retired. That 130 of them just said, I'm out of here. I guarantee you those cops are going to other police departments that love and appreciate them. 200 cops quit. Kentucky's largest city. What does that mean? The political gangsters say, yeah, we win. We win. We win. Uh, Ellison, the attorney general of Minnesota, who's a known socialist, uh, says that he's okay with international courts investigating the U.S. justice system. Can you imagine? The international courts covering our justice system. <laughs> Trump. Trump's given some interviews lately and he's talking about going back out on the campaign trail and that a 2024 decision would come after the 2022 elections. Trump is just getting it together. He's still the 5,000 pound gorilla in the political arena. Menthol cigarettes. I thought all cigarettes cause cancer. Joe Biden wants to not take out menthol cigarettes because they're especially bad for black people. More black privilege. They get special cigarettes canceled. I mean, are you not just sick and tired of black, 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 anything, anything black, 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 black. It's the most racist bullshit I've ever seen and dealt with in my 57 years of life. Federal interest rates they announced yesterday are going to be held at zero. Do you know why? Because we can't pay back 30 trillion in counting debt. 27 trillion. We might as well round it up to 30. It'll be past 30 before you know it. It's terrible. Box of chocolates. Can you imagine some son of a bitch denying a police officer a box of chocolates? 
I hope that that store, that person has a reckoning. Really? I'm not going to serve you. I guarantee you the person had to be white liberal. I don't know, but I bet you he's a white liberal. Uh, Max Kellerman, he's another one. ESPN says, you know, I keep hearing white, white, white draft picks. Really? He's trying to bring race into the NFL. I guarantee the NFL doesn't carry white, black, or blue. They pick the best freaking player at that darn position. But Max Kellerman is another example of the American Communist 10. He knows if he caters to the American Communist 10, he's going to get good ink. He's going to get good voiceovers. He is going to be one of their children. That's how it rolls. Everybody knows that if they say and do the right thing, they're in the club. And if you're in the American Communist 10 Club, nobody in that American Communist 10 will say a damn word bad about you. That's the way it works. Ohio. Ohio not only lost the congressional seat, they've lost their freaking minds. They're now going to allow people to change their gender on their damn birth certificates freely. If you're born with a willy whacker, you're a boy. If you're born without a willy whacker, you're a girl. Uh, Harris, I'm posting this newspaper article up because it's significant. Harris says we have to get ready for the next pandemic. Hmm, a prophet again, I've been telling you, the next pandemic is gonna come. The government has figured it out how to control all of you sheep. Pandemic! This is a bulldog. Every dog has their day. Have a great rainy Thursday.